3937 Southeast 9th Court. Nice little neighborhood here. All the houses are well kept and neat. So some of the windows have been replaced, but it's a traditional Florida home. We've still got the uh, soffit here that is just stucco and wood instead of aluminum. Uh, this is laminate flooring when you walk in. Um, you can see some bubbles and things coming. I mean, it's nothing high end. So this is your whole living area. Um, those doors pocket back. The French door is out of the breakfast nook. Um, the kitchen, they've put some different doors on, painted them, did some tile countertops. Um, we did do some recessed lighting and ceiling fans. A little different floor plan to the right when you walk in. One guest bedroom, again, freshly painted, new windows, ceiling fans. Uh, interior doors maybe have been painted. You can tell they painted over the hinges. Uh, guest bath here. Tile floor, a new vanity. Built-in shelves on each side. That is a new window here. And the original tub shower combo. And I don't know what's going on with the return air. It just fell down. Looks like it's missing hinge. So then this is the master bedroom. Again, the new eyebrow window across there, ceiling fan. Got a one pocket slider out of here. And then this is actually some, instead of totally raising the ceiling, they just took the dome out some recessed lighting, cultured marble, vanity, um, but this is all the master closet that you've got for clothes. Uh, pocket door here, nice retro look, the original green, walk-in shower, little tile, I mean that's actually all coming back style. That window has not been replaced. None of these sliders have been replaced. So you would not get the hurricane discount on your homeowner's insurance. No lights in there. So these are the original old cabinets. and they've painted the doors and the frames. You know, like that plug in there needs pulled out. Tile's too thick, nobody knew what they were doing. On the do-it-yourself project. And then over here is another nice big bedroom with a slider out, two impact windows, Small closet. This floor here, I'm not sure what they're doing with. This is, again, another little room, which I feel like it's an add-on because of this thick wall here with a little closet. And laundry is in the garage. You do have a walk door out. I'm not sure if that's an impact rated garage door or not. It's had a little bit of damage. Somebody's backed into it. Those are all the closet doors. Bifolds that are missing out of the house. And so the under truss area is decent. The lattice work, I mean, like there's all this cracked tile here. Um, so this is a pool liner. And when it's it's got dirt in it and it's got some wrinkles and that's what that dirt's catching in. The flat pool cage, so 
you know, I'm reaching right up here to touch it. Um, had had pool heater on the roof at one time and they've kept that off. Dead palm tree. I mean, I guess it's priced accordingly that you could do some work to it and make it your own. I can see that pool liner is coming off right over here, coming out. Mm. You know, here they've can, got some raw wood showing, probably some wood rot that looks wet back up in there. Definitely would have to do a few things. Okay.